Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. Hey, hey, hey. Dust. That's right, another pork rind recipe. What are we making today, guys? We're gonna try and do some fried chicken livers in our air fryer. So this is what we have, some fresh chicken livers and a colander, and we'll drain them. Gonna rinse them out. Then we're gonna let them drain in a bowl. All right guys, so next with our clean hands, we are gonna take the chicken livers and just put them on a paper towel. Let's see if we can get these dried up pretty well. All right, take a second layer of paper towels and let's just go ahead and pat these babies dry. So first guys, we are going to do a little test batch. Let me show you what I have. Let me show you what I have. I have three eggs. And then I have a cup of almond flour that has in it some slap your mama seasoning and some adobe seasoning and some black pepper. And that is it. So I have about a cup of the almond flour. In my third container, guys, I have my pork rinds. And we've got our first piece of liver. We're gonna put it in our egg mixture. And immediately after the eggs, it goes into the almond. Get that nice and coated. You hear that snorting, that's Daisy. Then back into the egg mixture. And here guys, it goes into the pork rinds. Here it is. I'm just gonna sprinkle the pork rinds all over it. Oh gosh has potential. We'll also be spraying this, guys, with coconut oil. All right, so I had it cooking at about 475, guys, uh, for about 20 minutes. Let's take it out. All right, and here's what it looks like. Not sure if it's cooked through yet. I'm gonna let it just kind of cool off. All right, guys, I have two more ready to go into my air fryer. Guys, when I tell y'all I have a small air fryer, I have a small air fryer. Look, this is the size of my hand. I actually have a relatively small hand, and it fits over this parchment. Yeah, small air fryer. So it's amazing what I can get done in that little baby. All right, guys, here we are. Check it out. A little crisp on certain edges. I don't know, let's see if it's cooked through. It looks cooked through. I'm gonna have a little bitesy here. Winner, winner, chicken liver dinner, guys. Holy guacamole. That's some good eating. Yeah. I am doing my happy dance, guys. Wow. All right, guys. Um, this is good. Check it out, guys. If you like chicken livers, you need to give this a try. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye-bye. Okay, guys. It's going to be really sad for David when he sees this video pop up in his <laughs> feed because he's probably not going to get any of it. It's so good. I might have to eat all of this by myself. Now, this is going to be a very high-protein meal, guys. So, you need to fatten it up. You can obviously eat some avocado uh, as long as you have enough carbs for that. What I did is I'm making a dip. You can do this with mayonnaise. I did it with two tablespoons of sour cream about half a teaspoon of some fresh garlic and uh, chili powder, about an eighth of a teaspoon. And then we're just gonna mix this together and hope it tastes good. Yeah, kind of like um, an aioli, but not. I like my baby spoon, I love baby spoons. We've had this conversation before. How many of you guys like eating certain foods with a baby spoon? Put it in the comments, all right? I'm gonna play the next two. We still have about seven minutes on the air fryer. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, 
and hit that notification button so that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye bye. Choice Wednesday, it's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah.